Sarah, 27, was allegedly left in tears when the doctor put her worries down to uni stress. Picture, Getty Images, a student who suffered from severe mental health problems was allegedly prescribed yoga and vegetables by a doctor who she felt dismissed her problems. Sarah, 27, an English literature graduate, says she was left in tears when a doctor told her she couldn't be mentally ill because mentally ill people don't seek help. However, the health service where the doctor works has responded stating that they take mental health extremely seriously and say it is necessary for doctors to ask a series of questions to establish that the medication is appropriate and safe to prescribe. Sarah told the Sheffield Tab that she first reached out for help in 2012 with symptoms of severe anxiety and depression, but was given an appointment with a doctor who put down her worries to uni stress. Advertisement Advertisement She said, he told me I can't be mentally ill because if people are mentally ill they don't know it so they don't seek help. He made me attend some stress workshops and told me to do yoga and eat some vegetables. He dismissed my worries and said it was just down to uni stress. The health service has responded saying it's necessary for doctors to ask a series of questions to establish that the medication is appropriate and safe to prescribe picture, Getty Images, I stock photo. After attending the meditation workshops, she says she found her mental health deteriorating and became really unwell after graduation. After beginning a master's in 2015, she went back to the same doctor who questioned why she was taking antidepressants for stress induced by a heart condition. She claims she left in tears and refused to see the doctor again. She also claims that her course of antidepressants had to be extended and she turned her back on seeking help at university for the rest of her course. Sarah lodged a formal complaint over her experience after speaking to a university counselor, but has decided not to pursue it. The service said in a statement that the doctor in question is a highly respected professional who consistently received positive feedback. A spokesperson said, We are sorry to hear that this patient was dissatisfied with our service as the health and well-being of our students is something we take extremely seriously. More, UK advertisement advertisement, as a practice we take pride in providing a high-quality service to our patients and received an outstanding rating for our care of students from the healthcare regulators, the Care Quality Commission. It is regrettable that we were not made aware of this patient's concerns at the time, as we take all complaints very seriously and use them as an opportunity to reflect on and inform service improvements. While we are unable to comment on this particular patient's experience, there is a strong evidence base for GPs to suggest exercise and relaxation techniques in the management of depression and anxiety as such lifestyle changes can have a significant impact on mental well-being, sometimes removing the need for medication. CCTV catches police posing for the Beatles Abbey Road picture at 2.30 m before medication is prescribed it is necessary for doctors to ask a series of questions to establish that the medication is appropriate and safe to prescribe. The GP in question is a popular and highly respected member of the team who has been working at the practice for over 15 years and consistently receives positive feedback about his performance. Advertisement Advertisement Let's Block